Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to another video. So in today's video we're gonna be doing how to always win skip tile mini game. This video is once again credits to its Cisco twins and sorry for being late for the new adopt me update it thing. And I'm also gonna be checking out the map with you guys. I haven't played adopt me in days and this update looks really cool they decorated the whole map. But before we start, make sure to like, subscribe, share, comment below video ideas. Anyways, let's start. So anyways, this is the haunted house. It looks really really cool. So much decoration. And I love it. Okay everyone, this is the tips on how to win but by the way the chickardist says game. I'm not really good at it, but it'll teach you guys how when I know how to. It'll make some tips for you guys. Tip number one. Okay, so in this game you'll have to jump on these tiles to find the correct path to get to the other side. If you fall off a tile don't worry because you'll be respawned back to the start. My trick is to Maximum amount of candy is to jump quickly between two tiles so you're able to know which ones are safe or not at the same time. You have to be really really quick as the time is clicking. So anyways, here's the second tip. So, this second tip is to use or make as many alt accounts as you can. It's really easy to make an alt account just use another device like your phone iPad. Your sibling's device. I recommend doing this because you can get double or triple. The amount of candy which is better to buy pets faster and make. Neons. So here's the next tip. Number 3. So tip number three is to not waste your candy on toys. I just wasted it on a pumpkin toy I couldn't resist is was to cutie. Why? Because most players don't really pay much attention to toys they don't really offer for toys and other stuff, like cars food and stuff during updates. So it is kind of hard to trade toys strollers cars food. So it's really useless. But it's up to you. I would say that buying some petware would be fine because there are a lot of people who actually do trade some good stuff for petware which will actually which will actually kind of grow your inventory tip number four so tip number four is very quick and easy so the tip is to let others go first you don't wanna risk falling okay so the other tips are gonna be really quick and easy too tip number five keep an eye on the time you don't have much time and don't chat while playing it will waste your time and you'll lose try to be in a public server for this minigame as it will get easier to get to the other side because you can follow the players you don't have to be the first one to go on the tiles you could guess the wrong tile and fall to the bottom so i guess that's it for the video you have reached the end subscribe and like for more videos and turn on the notification Tizem for watching and see you on another video.